what is going on you guys it's been a minute it's been a minute since i've seen y'all it's been a minute since i made a video but we are going out to a curve painting order today we're going out and i didn't walk out without my keys thank god i didn't lock the door but we are going out to curve painting today uh they gave me a call and they wanted to get a american flag so that's what we're going to give them they asked that if i did color and i just informed them i only do black and white as i mentioned before there's a lot of great people that do color i ju i'm just not one of them i don't do color so black and white it is but i also have another job coming up uh for a grocery store where i'm doing the front of their store with the uh, logo so i have to i have to order the stencils i gotta order the stencils and uh, that job is coming up here so I'll be looking for a video on that but glad to be back with y'all we're about to load up the car and head over there uh, i will see y'all when we get there all right guys we are at the location uh we're gonna move it right here you see the driveway is here and obviously we want to try to off center it uh, most of the time we try to line up with the house number but if there's, there's a driveway here where it's going to get backed over all the time we like to move it to the right so as always y'all know safety first so we coned it off we're going to be working in this area uh, it's super windy today it's super windy we look at the trees it's like super windy so we have to be careful when i'm spraying and make sure uh, he actually had his truck right here and he moved I asked him if he could move because i don't want any paint getting on his truck All right, y'all. So this is a uh, this is a flag logo. I guess one of the original. Uh, so this is the first time using that one, and uh, we got to lay it out. It is really windy, so it's, it's going to pose a little bit more than of a problem than I hope. I'm going to try to catch it in between the gusts of wind, because that's the thing. It's a really strong gust of wind. So as you see, the leaves and stuff flying around. That's going to be the problem. I'm trying to swat the leaves away <laughs> as I am uh, painting. But we're gonna do our best. Having it windy is terrible. Absolutely terrible. But let's see here, we're gonna go ahead and take this area out and try to go ahead and get started.
All right, y'all, look, it, considering how windy it is, this actually turned out really good. That's just because I took my time. Uh, no, not much overspray at all. The stars came out phenomenal. Um, yeah, it turned out really good. I'm shocked. <laughs> I'm shocked considering. But it's just after knowing how to spray, the angle to spray, when to spray, um, it just takes practice and time. And uh, that actually turned out really good. So I'm happy with it. Uh, I'm actually gonna spray the top coat on. And uh, we should be good to go. That's crazy. Let me get a nice picture of that before. And uh, I'm gonna spray the top coat on and then touch back with you. We are all finished. Look at that sunlight. Look at that beautiful. But we are all finished. Um, it turned out really good. I was shocked. As I said, because it's so windy, so much debris was spraying on top of it. I had to scrape it off. There's a lot of video y'all didn't see. Uh, so this actually took me about 20, a little over 20 minutes to get done because of all the prep work to ensure that stuff wasn't flying off. But that's just dealing, when you're dealing with the elements, that's just what you deal with. But it turned out really good. Uh, it's really simple. Uh, once again, I love black and white. I love black and white because it serves its purpose purpose of a curb address yes it's to accentuate the outside of your house but it's also for those emergency services uh, also for your package deliveries so i want to make sure it serves its true purpose which is helping you out in the long run so here's a couple of pictures also the paint is key i love this paint you guys can use whatever paint you want let me let me tell you why i love this paint so I get the, the Rust-Oleum, it has a multi-tip right there. Look, don't let, anyone, don't let anyone tell you what's right and what's wrong, all right? You figure that out for yourself. Use whatever paint you want. I like this one because it has the different tips right there. And it's perfect for these conditions because you can change it to more direct tip. You can change it to a fan tip, um, light spray. I love it. And it just sprays on really well. So to me, it's a nice quality paint. I did drop the link below uh, if you are interested in this paint. But you guys keep hustling out there. Thank you guys for keep rocking with me. And for those of y'all who plan on getting started, get started. What are you waiting for? Get out there and do it. Start with your own curves. Start with some family curves. That way, if you mess them up, <laughs> they can't be too mad at you. All right. Uh, you guys have a good rest of the weekend. And I will talk to y'all soon.